I saw the title, man. So I think like my 11th time trying to film this video, I haven't quite known how to just put it into words, but bottom line, man, I'm finally, finally sponsored. Finally, a Gymshark athlete. And I think, I think I'm um, the youngest athlete at that. I think I've got about five months left of being 17. So there's that as well. Um, I mean, there's not really much like that I know to say like right now because like you know getting found by Gymshark and getting sponsored was something that I've wanted to happen for like such a long time but I I never thought that would happen now like if you would have told me this time last year that this would be the position th this would be the position that I'm in right now being an actual Gymshark sponsored athlete and the youngest Gymshark sponsored athlete I would laugh in your face because at that time, you know, things, my channel, my Instagram wasn't going the ways that I thought it was going to go. And, you know, I saw myself eventually getting there, but not now. And it's just, it's just crazy that we're here now. And there's so many things I can say about the Gymshark brand, about being part of the Gymshark family, about you guys. But in the essence of time, because I've got a pretty nice little vlog for you guys at the end, I'm just going to touch on one thing. And that one thing is something that occurred to me a little while ago is that if you look at every single person that's actually on Gymshark who's about under the age of like 20 or so so you've got James English, Anthony Mantello, you've got Lex Little, you've got Oliver right all of those guys to my knowledge are either partly lifting or making content because of David Laid like it's crazy the amount of influence and impact that he's been able to have because you'll see you know like 1.4 million followers and you know you won't grasp how many people that is but the fact that every single person on Gymshark every single young person on Gymshark essentially has been inspired by him and is now in that position partly because of him kind of just shows me the power of both you know David Lane and his inspiration but also Gymshark because from watching him you know that made me want to be a Gymshark athlete that made me you know want to wear Gymshark clothes and as well as you know obviously other guys like Lex Little and guys like that guys that I look up to and now you know peers all of that stuff in general just made me want to you know grind harder in the gym and just keep going so essentially what I'm trying to get across is that I just hope that by being part of the Gymshark family and by you know continuing to document my journey on YouTube and whatever I can inspire someone and, you know, have the same thing that happened with, you know, guys like David Laid with me, have that happen for someone else. I want someone, I want the next, you know, young up and coming person that gets signed by Gymshark or another company to say, yeah, I was inspired, you know, by Nathaniel, you know, watching Nathaniel's videos is like part of the reason why I'm here now. So if that can happen, then I will be fully content and all of the hard work, all of the, all of the editing, grinding in the gym, all that stuff will be worth it because the bottom line is if you can't inspire someone else to be better to do better then you know you're, you're wasting your time you're not making a difference and people aren't necessarily going to be remembered for the amount of followers they had or the amount of money that they made but it's the amount of impact that they actually have the amount that they actually touched people but yeah I just hope through what I'm doing I can impact someone for the better and help someone you know start their fitness journey and just get on that path because I can say that me starting my fitness journey has changed my life in so many different ways that I don't even have time to get into but yeah it's just being a part of Gymshark is is such an honour and again I just have to say thank you to all of you guys for getting me in this position thank you to everyone on the Gymshark team I'm so happy to be part of the team it's probably not even going to you know sink in until 
I go to some sort of event or something like that because it's just it's just something that I didn't even think could happen to me. So again, so happy to be part of the Gymshark family. And yeah, so I know a lot of you have been um, anticipating this. I've been teasing it a little bit. But yeah, it's, it's, it's official now. I'm officially a Gymshark athlete and I'll have a link very, very soon where you can shop Gymshark stuff and it will really support me. So yeah, if any of you guys want to you know, support me in my journey and can help me continue, then using my link will be a really big help. So probably a little after this video is put out, there'll be a link that'll be in all of my descriptions, all of my Instagram bios and stuff where you can get Gymshark stuff through my link and it will support me. So yeah. That is that. Um, there's not too much else to say about that. I'm just going to leave you guys with a little vlog, a little barbecue, a little home full body workout that I did. And yeah, see you guys in a bit. Peace. What's up guys? It's your boy Nathaniel Messiah. So in today's video, we're not going to be testing our strength skills. We're going to be testing our barbecuing skills. So what's going on in barbecue in a second is got some of these beef quarter pounders. We've got some sausages. We've got some vegetarian sausages. We got some of this halloumi cheese. Uh, we're also gonna be going on with some corn and stuff. So, yeah, just gonna kick back on this bank holiday Monday, get a quick barbecue in, and uh, yeah, just have a good time. So we've got um, one of these like, electrical barbecues instead of the cold ones. They heat up quicker and it's just quicker to deal with. So this all going on. Gas barbecues, gas barbecues. Mum's correcting me. You tell, wanna tell the people, Mum? Wanna say? Hi. Hello. Hello. Nice. Welcome Lovely. to our barbecue. Hey, we love to see it. <laughs> Have to say, Mum, hair looking lovely as look as usual. Oh, thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Don't get too oh, gassed. Can too. <laughs> a bit quick promo. <laughs> Anything you want to tell the people, Joshua? Uh, are you telling me nothing? <laughs> it's chilling. Not planned. What do you say? This is not planned. Not planned. This is not planned. Come on, that's the, the best one. Spontaneous things. No, no, this is not Two things mandatory for a barbecue. Obviously, that barbecue sauce, that oil to make sure things don't stick. Not too much of that though, we want to stay shredded. Go. What are we saying? Anything you want to say to the people on this fine day, Dad? Um, I thank God for a lovely sunny day. Yep. Um, for food yep. and for family. Yep. And uh, this is going to be good. It's going to be good. It's going to be good. <laughs> you don't really, for how hot this is, get the mandatory you don't really shades. right now with the fence. Really. Alright guys, we've got the sausages nice and barbecued. We've got the burgers sitting in there as well. Just going on the halloumi, some more sausages, got some sweet corn in there. Looking good. How are we doing? Alright, so this is what the finished product is saying. I think we did decent. Those were my dad's veggie ones that he won up, but these are the beef ones. We've got that sweet corn, we've got them buns, we got that. We got an Ashley in the natural habitat. What do you want to say to the people? Hi guys. Hey. <laughs> you just put me on the spot. Hi there. Hi. Hey. <laughs> Ethan. Hello, everybody. Yeah, sub to my YouTube channel. Right, Alright, shut your thing out. Exploding I, Ethan. Yeah, everybody, sub to my YouTube channel right now. Right, right now. now. What are you going to do if they don't sub you? If they don't sub you, you, you don't want to know what's going to happen. Alright, Ethan, give them a headbutt. Give them a headbutt. Give them a headbutt. Oh, you don't want to mess with him. You don't want to mess with him. You don't want to mess with him. Alright, that's what the plate's saying. We've got that hot dog with that extra burger. we got a burger. Some cheese in there. That sweet corn. That's what everyone's saying. Good. Very Focus. nice. Mm -hmm. We'd love to see it. Alright, cool. Compliments yeah, to the chef. Thank you very much. Much appreciated. Bartender. Bartender. <laughs> cool.